Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back. I'm Melanie Kate Love and thank you so much for joining me here for another episode. Today I wanted to talk you through what my advice to my younger self would be. Now if you've been following me for a while, all the way through from when I was raw nourishment talking about just veganism, to now when I'm more spiritually evolved, you're probably assuming what I'm going to say. Well, my first piece of advice, which I think is the most important and it's going to stem down to kind of infiltrate the rest of the things that I want to talk to you about. Number one is follow your intuition. That is my biggest piece of advice. Why? Because if you follow your intuition, you tap into the frequency of love, the divine, your higher self, your angels if you're that spiritually inclined and it is a beautiful place to be because when you listen to your intuition you basically close the gap of resistance and you get rid of everything that doesn't serve you and you start following this guidance inside of you that leads you to your higher self and that higher self is the most beautiful place to be and it's taken me 30 years to work out how to do that and I wish that someone told me that when I was younger. So that's why it is my most important piece of information is to honestly follow your intuition. Now, in order to get to there, there's a couple of things that I would recommend. Number one is through meditation. Because through meditation, you're able to quiet your mind. And that's when I have learned to reconnect with my higher self, my angels, the universe, everything. I just found that when you silence the mind, you just, I don't know, you just get this natural high and it is such an exciting place to be. So meditation was one way that I got there. Another way is being in mother nature. Mother nature has this beautiful frequency of just pure positive energy that helps to recalibrate yourself and put you back into alignment. The other one is to practice daily self-love. If you're following your intuition, you already know to do things that make you feel amazing. Today, I started going for like a more punk kind of rock look and I just followed my intuition. This is my second video that I filmed today, but I'm, my intuition kind of was like, okay, you do your hair like this now. Um, yep, we're gonna do the punk look, so let's get your skull and crossbones headscarf that you got when I used to work for Disney, um, which we had for pirate night. And you know, and then we're gonna put these earrings in and put this in and perfect. And I was like, okay, I just kind of went with it, which is a really beautiful thing. So that's my biggest piece of advice. It's follow your intuition, work out how to get there. Meditation, mother nature, yoga is another one. Um, and listen to your body, because when you listen to your body, which is also listening to your intuition, work out how do you feel in certain situations. If you were around someone and they're draining your energy, it's probably not good for your higher self. If you're with someone and they boost you up and they make you feel like the most beautiful person in the whole wide world, stay friends with that person. Keep them around you regularly. And yeah, listen to your body in regards to the food that you're eating. Um, what I have learned on my journey is that eating a simplified diet, you know, getting rid of animal products and um, really anything animal related get that out of your diet and you instantly just you just take on this oh, I don't know you just feel so good um, but in saying that you can be an unhealthy kind of vegan um, but just simplify it so eating fruits and veggies in their most natural form gives you the healing properties and energy of mother nature and you take on that energy when you digest it and you start you know your, your consciousness rises, your vibration rises, your frequency, you just, you feel absolutely amazing. But the way that I found all of those things was listen, li literally listening to my body. And it is a beautiful place to be. So Mel, my younger self, that is my advice to you. Follow your intuition and it will lead you to your higher self. Well, my loves, there you go. I hope this has helped you. If you're new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe so you never miss another episode. I make videos every Tuesday and Sunday at 6 a.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time, and I'm here to make you feel like the most beautiful person in the whole wide world. Why? 
because it's going to help you close the gap of resistance and vibrate on the frequency of love. I'm all about the mind, body and soul nourishment and it has led me to where I am today and I am so very grateful to be here. Well, my love, if you would like to find out more information about my healing transformation, please check out the end card where I'll link my healing and transformation series and stay tuned because I'm gonna be releasing an updated version about everything that I've been through on my journey to become my greatest version. Exciting, I know. Have an amazing day wherever you are in the world. Remember, continue to make better choices so you, my love, can vibrate on the frequency of love, the most beautiful place to be. Bye.